Hi, my name is Skylar Kurgil, and I'm a 23-year-old poet, activist, artist, and musician from Boston, Massachusetts. I would say that one of the hardest things I've ever overcome was that initial moment when I told my family who I was, that I felt my gender identity didn't match with what I'd been assigned at birth, and that I wanted to be their son, that I felt like I was my parents' son. And that was the hardest conversation for me to have because in that moment, I knew I could either be accepted and embraced and continue having this wonderful family or that I could be rejected and denied and really not know what to do with my life at 15 years old. So I'm very blessed that my parents with a little bit of education came around and allowed me to live as who I am before I went to college, which graduating from college was one of the best things that I ever did. I have a bunch of dreams now, although I'm somewhat directionless. I'm currently working on my music and a memoir, but also planning on going back to graduate school in Boston for social work. I'm hoping to continue working with LGBT youth and families and to be able to continue to make a difference in this way that I have been that's been so rewarding for me. I would say though that the one thing that I've really learned through this whole experience over the past eight years of my life is sort of like that phrase, never judge a book by its cover. Well, I've really learned not to judge human beings by the way that we look, by our bodies. I mean, it's a nice gift that's been given to us, but the only thing we can really control is our minds and the choices that we make and our actions and our reactions. And I find myself exploring people more fully and more beautifully now that I don't really regard gender or bodies as any sort of label for them, just beings that are often really great.